What's your name, kid? Yeah, you, yeah, yeah, you. I've got a little bit of a lazy eye, but we... <laughs> we're in the fucking middle of a conversation, mate. <laughs> Literally talking to you about two minutes ago, and you're like... Is this Gossie Prick still talking to me? It's fucking out of order, that, mate. You've done my fucking head in there, you know. <laughs> I have to have Mackies on the way home now. What do you do, mate? Dig a drive there like a little five year old boy's dream. Oh, <laughs> boss, that man. <laughs> so fucking sad, isn't it? <laughs> He's mentally still there. <laughs> oh, one nil, dickhead. <laughs> You skip me, she skips you. Fuck off. Mm. Are you together? Ah, yeah, I'm assuming. Beautiful. How long have you been together for? Four years in. Not happy now. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> Feeling all right? Feeling good? Where you living? Warrington. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> what have you got? Not by colour as well. <laughs> what have you got going on? You got a little new build or something? Little semi? Something? Moving in on Sunday. Ah, oh, congrats, man. That's nice, that. What have you got? <laughs> How many beds? <laughs> She's moving in with you, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> Are you wearing a state agent, sir? <laughs> Where the fuck is that? <laughs> like that? That's a I can just be, It's not even like you've been a noisy prick all night. Like, there's been no noise in there at all. You're like, fucking get on the moving on with the lives. <laughs> That was amazing. That was real. Like I like, appreciate that. That was like Instagram positivity. That was good. That... Yeah. Are you are you moving soon or something? You're excited about it. What's happening? <laughs> what the fuck is going? <laughs> it's not just me, is it? That's weird. That. That's weird. That's weird. That's one of the weirdest things I've ever known in my life. How excited are you about? Do you, do you like build houses or something? I, I, do you live in like a bad house? Do you hate your house? Where do you live? Pilch Lane. Yeah, I can see why you want a new house. <laughs> Who do you live? Let, let's have a look here. Which one is it? I can't see over there. It's dead dark and that. How are you? You're right. How was your mixed chicken sandwich, mate? <laughs> You're right, you've missed fucking chaos here, you know, kid. It's been going off. Give him his cocaine back. It's <laughs> 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 been murder here, you know, I've been talking to these. He's a bit of a fucking ignorant prick, but he's sad. <laughs> They're not very happy they've been together four years and after moving into a new house on Sunday thinking it's going to save the relationship, but it's probably not. <laughs> She's dead happy about it for some reason. <laughs> don't know why. Just don't know why. What's your name, dead excited girl? <laughs> Is it Emma? You right, Ems? I can't see you. You're right, Ems. Are you with Ems? Emma, Is it? <laughs> Didn't ask that, did I? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Answer me questions. <laughs> Are you with Emski? Adele. You were fucking dead loud a minute ago. Adele, All right, love, fucking <laughs> Feisty. Single M's. <laughs> oh, <laughs> new house banter's making sense now, isn't it? <laughs> Get out of my dreams. <laughs> Did you, yeah? What happened? Fucked them off. Oh, well, uh, what did he do? Cheat on you or something? How do you know? What happened? Fucking bin him. Look at these, tell him. Go ahead, it'll go on Facebook, it'll be funny. <laughs> Why did you say that like a robot? Incompatible. I hope you said that when he tried to put his willy in, that would have been amazing. <laughs> Incompatible. <laughs> <laughs> Just like shut the <laughs> Oh, I like you, Emsky, you're nice, man. 
What do you do, Ems? Working as solicitors. Oh, fucking hell, is that you on the end? You're fit, you are smash you all day. <laughs> I thought it was the one next year, I wasn't keen, but like. <laughs> 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 I'm only messing out there. I'm only messing out there. I'm only joking. That was a joke. <laughs> I'll buy his mouth for Mackie's later. <laughs> Get a brekkie in the morning, don't we, sir? <laughs> oh, Emski, Emski, Emski. So, so you're working as solicitors? You live on Pilch Lane and that? And you're you single now, is it? Don't fucking go quiet on me, am I? <laughs> you ever had angry sex with a ginger man? Fucking answer me right now. <laughs> what? <laughs> Once and it wasn't me. All right, love, fucking hell. Well, why are you getting angry at me then? <laughs> Did you enjoy it? <laughs> I can feel the tension and you think I'd move on, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm talk to Emma for a bit. Do you want to go on a little date with me, Ems? I'm married enough, but I'll fuck it off you, right? <laughs> I hate my wife. Oh, my God. So, don't fucking lie. You've never met her. She's a fucking prick. Mate. She is an absolute fucking knobhead, and I can't stand there. She does me fucking head in. I got, yeah, yeah, Emma, a little question for you, because you, like, you just got in, like, you just got out of a relationship and all that. I, I got married on the 29th of January this year. When is the last time I had sex? <laughs> the 29th of January. Well done. <laughs> And she tried to get out of that shit. That's how much of a fucking nubbed she is. And you know what? We've been together for eight years. We've got two kids and that. I understand it's hard, you know what I mean? You've got to keep the dream alive and all that. Like, you've got to go out your way to like, like, make it feel romantic and stuff like that. You've got to take it out. You've got to wine and dine. You've got to make it feel special to get her in the mood and all that. But I made her a fucking princess for the day. And there's not much more I can do on my end. I gave her a fucking wedding day, mate. And like, I, I, in a beautiful hotel, a lovely surroundings. We had all of our family there. It was lovely, amazing. We goes back to the honeymoon suite. There's champagne. There's rose petals on the bed and shit. She's like, oh, babe, I'm tired, can we do it in the morning? I was like, fucking no. <laughs> I have spent 18 grand on this wedding. You better get your fucking knickers off right now. <laughs> like, immediately though. Get your knickers off now. She was like, I don't know. I was like, you fucking do? It's the law? <laughs> like, the law's on my side here, mate. You don't have sex with me now. This doesn't even count. Get your fucking knickers off right now. Like, don't, like, don't tell me what to do. What to do. <laughs> I got dead angry. I know what I did them. So I just, I don't know why I did it. I just started shouting. Put me really in your mouth right now when I phone the police. <laughs> <laughs> she was just staring. I was like, put my willy in your mouth right now or I will phone the police. <laughs> it's up to you. It's 69 or 999. Judge it. <laughs> 